minus 10, 9, 8, 7. This video shows teams from NASA and Northrop Grumman fire a ground-based version of a booster for the agency's SLS, Space Launch System, rocket June 26. Secured horizontally in a test stand at Northrop Grumman's test facility in Promontory, Utah, the single five-segment booster motor fired for more than two minutes and produced 3.9 million pounds of thrust. This test was the first full-scale ground test of a new five-segment solid rocket motor. During the test, there was an abnormal event approximately 15 seconds before the end of the motor firing. Despite this event, NASA achieved several of the test's primary objectives and received valuable data on technical risks identified ahead of the test. 